Hey there everybody, Eric from Outer Limitless coming at you today with another video. Now today's video is the type of video I really enjoy doing. The reason why I enjoy it is because I can finally give something back to somebody who's actually done something for me. You know, through life I've been very fortunate. I've had some excellent opportunities provided to me from my parents, from my friends, from employers, different people who have actually guided me along the way and helped me to become who I am today. Now in today's video, in a very similar way, I'm talking about a couple of different people who I've run into in various ways and these people have definitely made an impression on me. And so what I'm doing today is showing you something that I have actually had specifically made for somebody in the YouTube community that has taught me a whole bunch of stuff. Now this YouTube personality is someone that I've been watching for a number of years now. I've watched them develop and grow. I've watched their channel grow up and just become something that's great entertainment, excellent entertainment value. It gives me a lot of ideas about what I like to do, how I want to be inspired to go into the outdoors. I enjoy the actual uh, you know, creative aspect of the videos and what this guy's doing to really bring some good entertainment to all of us. And so I'm not going to go into any detail about who this is, but rather I'm going to show the little product that I've had actually handmade. It's a small gift I'm gonna to send to this person and I wanted to show that to you today. Now in a prior video, I brought to you guys the work of Jonathan Yekic. Now Jonathan's a guy that I met through the Instagram community. I saw his work on his Instagram account and instantly found it to be unique and interesting. He basically makes these little hand carved beads for lanyards that can be used for a number of different things. Now I got this particular Punisher bead uh, custom made for me by Jonathan. I asked him if he could make a Punisher bead. He made it and this is what he sent to me. I very much have enjoyed this. I've used it as a knife lanyard for my Benchmade Arvensis. And these little beads are pretty cool. So I've since had a couple more made and I thought this would make a pretty neat and unique present for somebody. And like I said, I chose somebody in the YouTube community who has inspired me and thought I would send them a product very similar to this. So as I said, I'm not going to mention any names of the specific YouTube channel, but this little bead I had carved into the head of a German Shepherd. And if any of you are familiar with a dog named Scout, you'll know exactly which channel I'm talking about. Now what I like about Jonathan's work is that even though his beads are quite small, they have a lot of detail. He really takes the time to try to make something that looks authentic to what he's trying to create, puts a lot of time into the carving, a lot of time into the painting, and just does a really nice job. Now with this bead, I talked with Jonathan about what we could do and talked about the idea of potentially making this into a ferro rod, which if any of you are familiar with some of the story as to why this YouTuber could use a ferro rod, I think you'll understand why I wanted to send one to him. But at the same time, we were a little bit worried about if we carved out the bottom of this, that we'd lose some of the integrity of the thickness on the bead and it could potentially just be ultimately destructive to it. And at the same time, we figured something like a lanyard is actually a little more versatile where this could be used on either a knife or as a zipper pole or something like that. And for this particular lanyard, we have a little camo style paracord the bead, a couple nice little knots with a weathered nut. It's just an interesting look and a nice little product. So all right guys, there you have it. A nice little look at the work of Jonathan Yekich. I highly suggest you check out his work. Take a quick look at the link below for his work on Instagram. He has a number of different beads that are very similar to this in size, but all unique in their own way. Lots of different characters and different styles and things like that. So 
certainly a product that if you're interested in this, you could definitely get one for yourself. Nice custom made and a unique little piece. And furthermore, I'd just like to say thanks to Scout and his owner and his YouTube channel and everything that he's done for me. Um, you may not realize this, but you are an influence to a lot of people. We enjoy your work in terms of just your overall channel, uh, what you do as far as your skills, uh, your artistic ability, and what you've actually helped inspire me to do myself with my own channel. And so this is just a nice little gift, something small that I can send back to you just as a token of my thanks. So, all right, guys, thanks for stopping by. I hope you like what you saw. I hope you found it a little bit informative. If you like what you saw, please like, share, and subscribe. And as always, thanks for stopping by. Take care now. I'll see you soon.